The president denied any wrongdoing, but his administration has refused to allow calls to turn over a whistleblower complaint about it. Acting National Intelligence Director Joseph McGuire will be pressed to do just that when he appears before the House Intelligence Committee on Thursday. In a letter to lawmakers today, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi hinted at the possibility of impeachment, warning, quote, if the administration persists in blocking this whistleblower from disclosing to Congress a serious possible breach of constitutional duties by the president, they will be entering a grave new chapter of lawlessness, which will take us into a whole new stage of investigation. Now, other Democrats are being much more blunt in their calls for impeachment. But KPX5 political reporter Melissa Kane tells us one presidential candidate who has not joined the chorus may surprise you. The conversation was absolutely perfect, absolutely appropriate. The president told reporters today he did nothing wrong in his conversation with Ukrainian president, although he did admit they talked about Joe Biden and his son, Hunter Biden. While Joe Biden was vice president and involved in Ukrainian issues, Hunter Biden was hired as an executive at a Ukrainian natural gas company. It was largely the fact that we don't want our people, like Vice President Biden and his son, creating to the, the corruption already in the Ukraine. In Ukraine, uh, Ukraine's got a lot of problems. He, the new president is saying that he's going to be able to rid the country of corruption. And I said that would be a great thing. But Trump denies the allegation that he pressured the Ukrainian government to investigate the Bidens. There was no pressure, no nothing. There was no pressure. Still, someone who reportedly was not a witness to the call filed a whistleblower complaint about the conversation. And a Trump-appointed inspector general declared that complaint urgent and credible. House Intelligence Committee Chairman Adam Schiff said today if the president is innocent, he should turn over the transcript of that call and the whistleblower complaint. Clearly, he's afraid for the public to see uh, either one of those things. Congressman Schiff has been opposed to impeachment proceedings in the House, but today he said if the president did leverage military aid to get dirt on a political opponent, impeachment may be the only answer. That may be the only remedy that is co-equal to the, the evil uh, that that conduct represents. Several Democrats running for president were more direct. It is time for us to call out this illegal behavior and start impeachment proceedings right now. We need to absolutely right away begin impeachment proceedings. He's got to go. If ever there were a time to impeach and hold the president accountable, it is now. It's a mistake not to impeach this president. But one Democrat who has not called for impeachment is Joe Biden, who instead has called for an investigation. Depending on what the, what the House finds, he could be impeached, but I'm not making that judgment now. The House should investigate it. Melissa Kane, KPIX 5.